Another business in the Pettigrew Heights neighborhood west of downtown Sioux Falls will no longer sell alcohol after the license renewal was voted down by the city council. It's an effort to help with crime problems near the businesses along West 11th Street. On the night beat, Catalan's Carter Schmidt explains the council's effort to clean up the area. Good evening, Carter. Good evening, Don and Bridget. Tonight, the council voted 7-1 to one against the renewal of the malt beverage license for La Tapatia Mexican Store, which is in the same building as the Lucky Lady Casino, which closed last week week. Counselors against the renewal are staying consistent with a pattern of whether the businesses in the area are in a suitable location to sell alcohol. Last week, the owners of the Lucky Lady Casino pulled their request for malt beverage license renewals and closed down the establishment. Now, just a couple doors down, La Tapatia Mexican store will soon stop selling alcohol. Counselor Greg Neitzert says he visited the store and restaurant last week and reiterates it's a very good business that is not the problem, but falls under a precedent the council has set. I don't want them to be harmed, and so I don't want any inference whatsoever that this has anything to do with how they run their business, uh, their conduct, their professionalism. Um, they're, they're frankly, to me, a, a victim of circumstance in this case. Neitzert says after his conversations with the business owner, he learned that crime has negatively impacted her store. It's clear we need to act. It's past time. The neighborhood has suffered for too long. It's, this has festered. Um, and it's had significant challenges. La Tapatia owner Josefina Marquez spoke at the meeting with a translator and does not believe her store contributes to the problems, but she is willing to help. For me, si la licencia te tiene que retirar para que ese lugar esté mejor, lo acepto. If it's my license that you're going to take off because of beer, I agree with that. Pero mi opinión es que nada más no sea yo. Que sea Mercato y que sea Manchis también. Uh, but my opinion is that if you take my license, also you can take uh, Mercato and Manchis. It's a plan for some council members to follow the same pattern going forward for other alcohol license renewals nearby. I would also just mention anybody else in the immediate vicinity, particularly in the building, consider yourself on notice and plan accordingly because I would intend to keep consistent with this. I, hopefully along with some other counselors, will be looking at any legal options that we have before us as well to pull any other liquor or alcohol licenses sooner uh, rather than later. And so looking at options there as well, but making sure we're consistent that this is not a suitable location at this time. And the malt beverage license for La Tapatia expires on June 30th. Mercado and other businesses sells alcohol at the end of that same building. Their off-sale liquor license is up for renewal in the fall.